From our New York studios, welcome to Auctionata, sale number 188, Asian works of art. Part of Asia Week, just kicking off here in New York City, Auctionata is offering this comprehensive survey of Chinese ceramics and other objects, featuring works from the Sung Dynasty all the way to the Republic era. Lot number 26 is a carved yellow jade abstinence plaque from China. This is a personal and very touching piece. You can tell when the pieces have a certain personal relationship and that patina of, of use and contact. Sold to Chu for $7,000. That was one of my favorites. And we move on to another of the breathtaking highlights of today's sale, Lot 52. It's a beautiful item and Phoenix had Tang Sansa Yours don't come to market that often. This was deaccessioned from what was then called the Art Institute of Zanesville, Ohio, and now is called the Zanesville Art Museum. And we have even the insurance waiver listing the Ewer, as well as correspondence between C.T. Liu and the director of the museum. Sold to a bidder in California for $26,000. Lot 67 is a favorite of ours here on the set. This is a carved white jade snuff bottle from China from the 18th and 19th century. And the starting bid here is $5,000. I'm at 7,500 looking for 8,000. 7,500 connoisseurs, collectors, aficionados, no quality when they see it. And that's driving this all the way up to $17,000 right now. And I'm looking for 18. $36,000 for a partner bidder and sold for $40,000 to a bidder at a partner site, Live Auctioneers. I have bids from the floor, from the phones, and online. And we move on to lot 104, a Shu Yi Lu immortal painting from China. This immortal in particular is Ri Zhi Gong Cao, one of the four Si Zhi Gong Cao um, immortals who were in uh, Taoist imagery, but then also became a part of folklore and folk religion in China as well. We have many bidders that have come in from Asia Week. Sold for $6,000 to a bidder here in the room at Auctionata in Manhattan. Lot number 85 is a Kubera figure from Sino-Tibet. 18th and 19th century, and the starting bid here is $15,000. Provenance from an ex-private European collection. We're at $18,000 from Susan in the United Kingdom. Century gilt bronze figure of Kubera, the deity of wealth. Sold for $19,000 to a bidder at our partner site, Live Auctioneers. Mm -hmm. 